We got a Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody is dealing with somebody who dealt with someone in the past that just was not reliable. Very flighty. You could be dealing with somebody here who's, who gambles. They take too many risks. Okay. Uh, somebody's very irresponsible here. It's a no. What else here for the collective? Oh, oh, oh somebody getting justice. Somebody might have legal problems. Either this, either your person, all right? Either your person with this Knight of Pentacles in reverse or the justice sign. You could be dealing with a Libra or they could be like a younger earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Somebody could be having legal problems and they could be in jail. They could be going to jail. They could have just gotten out of, out of jail. Someone here could be receiving karma for whatever they did. Meaning whatever bad decisions they made. Because it does look like someone made bad decisions here. They didn't make the best choices. Um, naturally, whatever karma and whatever, they, whatever energy they put out. Oh, look at that. The Ace of Cups. With the King of Cups. Ooh, I told you y'all had new love coming in here. I told y'all. Anywho, um, this could be you receiving good good karma too. All right. Uh, for dealing with somebody like this in the past. Either way, this is past energy. This person that could have showed up in that way, this unreliable person, the person who made bad choices and decisions, they may want to bring balance back into a, something with you as well. Let's pull some more cards and see. Yeah, these are still making bad choices. King of Pentacles in reverse. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. They're still making bad decisions, y'all. Somebody has a legal problem. Okay. Somebody is having le somebody could for real have a real addiction here. They're just making really bad, poor financial decisions. Hmm. Somebody here cares about what 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 label they wear. Whoa. They care about what what brand something is. Hold on, something fell on the floor. <clears throat> The Empress is out here. I feel like this is you. You're still confused about a situation. I do feel like you've turned your back on this masculine here. You've turned your back on this King of Pentacles in reverse you, because you just weren't sure about them. I don't know. I, I don't. You, you're. Some of y'all could be in denial. I don't know. Or you could be stuck in the middle. I don't know what that energy is about. The two, the two of swords, and then the Empress is out here. Could be somebody they're dealing with. The Ten of Swords just fell on top of the Justice card, which means somebody definitely is getting their, their 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 rightful justice here, their rightful karma. They're getting what is owed to them, or they really are having some legal problems. <clears throat> mm. Okay. Show me more. Four swords. Dang, what is going on? Four swords in reverse. Somebody could be sick. <clears throat> Somebody could be sick here. Mm. But we'll see. I don't even know if this is. Show me more. That fell out sideways. I don't even know which way that was supposed to be the oh good grief god almighty the magician in reverse gemini energy the ten of wands in reverse man somebody's in a, this this king of pentacles is in some form of illusion or living in la la land somebody here is in a, a master narcissist uh a master deception like they paint pictures they they can convince any like this is somebody who can who was like top salesman of the year okay this is somebody here who has talents and god given gifts and they use them for evil or they use them for the wrong to get the wrong thing right they use them for their own gain which but the, the gain that that they want is something in the 3d ooh 
Somebody is really feeling overwhelmed here from their decisions and their choices. It's Ten of Wands in reverse. Somebody's getting ready to drop a whole bunch of shit. <sighs> Somebody's about to make a decision to... That's this masculine. This masculine is realizing all the risk that they took, all the things that they did. They are seeing like... What an awful thing this was. Ooh, the death card in reverse. Scorpio energy here. This See, this masculine is afraid of change. This is awful. Three of wands in reverse. This person refuses to grow. This person is not learning the lesson that they're supposed to be learning here. The fool card next to the death card in reverse and the three of wands in reverse is energy of um, this Aries or Aquarius energy here. This is somebody here who just is not ready to learn. They're not ready to grow. They, they're they still immature. They definitely take risk. You definitely could be dealing with a gambler. And this is definitely somebody here who is very, like I said, like cares about what label something is how something looks on the outside how much something costs or like they care about the brand or what it's called or like the impression that it gives other people because even in this fool card there's somebody you're taking a, a selfie right they're taking this selfie they got on this cute dress and these heels I, they're not heels but i'm envisioning them as heels <laughs> they're converse like chucks and like they got this purse and they're just like, oh, take a picture pose, strike for the camera. You know what I'm saying? Like, they are really, like, giving materialistic tower. Boy, tower. It's, it's on. You hear me? This person refuses to change. This is crazy. Somebody here is, like trying to delay the inevitable somebody's life is getting ready to crumble the tower in reverse is here the death card in reverse is here the three of wands in reverse is here scorpio energy they're not going to be able to avoid whatever's happening in their life right now or if they could be going through a tower moment and they're doing everything they can to try to over overt it uh and spirit is like no bring that ass over here come here sit down let me sh i gotta tell you something Jeez, page of cups in reverse. Whoever this is, you guys, has some growing up to do. They have some lessons and some things they need to learn. You could be dealing with a younger water sign here, a Cancer Pisces, or a Scorpio light. This is a, a, a master manipulator, male or female, doesn't matter. Master manipulator here. Someone here has, was they were neglected as a child. And I'm not being funny. I'm really not. This person is extremely insecure about themselves. They have a lot of inner childhood wounds. Um, wow. I don't know. Hmm. Show me more about this page. Let me find out who this empress is real quick. Give me more on the empress. I really feel like you're the empress, but let me double check. Show me the empress energy, please. Uh oh, show me Empress Energy, please. Hmm. You you know what? Let me get one more card before I say that. Give me one more on the Empress. Um, there's an, there's a divine feminine here. I don't think this is you. Either this is this masculine's mother or this is a, a karmic that they're dealing with right now. The nine of swords is here reverse. The sun is here reverse and the ace of swords is here upright. Either somebody here is getting some clarity about something. Um, but I really feel like I, someone here was delusional or in some form of delusion, right? Um, because somebody here could either, this feminine could be dealing with some form of shame, some form of guilt, or somebody could really have like some mental health Ill issues. Or this this person, this king of pentacles in reverse, has all these issues because of their mother. Um, 
That's why. Okay. And whoever this empress is, this is not a happy person. Somebody here might be realizing that they have mother wounds or whoever this person is attached to this king of pentacles in reverse. This feminine is realizing they're not happy anymore. Give me one more on the, uh, somebody could be a Leo or an air sign. Give me one more on this empress. So, so this, this empress is in denial about this king of pentacles in reverse. They're in denial. Definitely could be a family situation for sure. There are some form of financial issues going on here in this situation. The Knight of Swords is here. Um, could be some arguments. Somebody is trying doing. They're going through a lot of shit. Whoever this is, somebody's going through some form of money problems here. With this Ten of Pentacles, it's a family situation. Five of Pentacles is here in reverse and the Knight of Swords is here. It's like there are some issues going on in a, in a family situation in a home. Uh, so, okay. Show me more about this Empress. So, this is, I mean, I don't know who you resonate as. So, somebody is trying to do everything they can. They're repressing their emotions. What does this have to do with the collective? What is this? Thank you. Oh, so. Oh. The high priestess in reverse Pisces energy, you guys. Hmm. Damn, what is going on? This is crazy. I feel like somebody tried to delay, either somebody tried to delay something that happened or they tried to delay some news or somebody tried to keep you from hearing about the truth. Mm. Somebody tried to keep, stop you from figuring out their motive, like a negative motive though. Somebody wanted you in confusion. What does this have to do with the collective? They wanted you in chaos. Yeah. But I feel like you got clarity that you need. And you're actually happy and you're in a healing phase. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Damn, somebody, it's like somebody wanted you in chaos or something. Or, and somebody here is imbalanced. Somebody here is not um, doing well. I don't know what this has to do with you, but somebody here is not doing well. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Hope I'm making sense. You could be, you could, somebody here could be a Pisces, an Aquarius, an Aries, Leo, or a Sag, Libra, Scorpio, Gemini. Could be anybody, okay? Show me more about this situation. Somebody definitely for sure here is very insecure and, and uh, has some form of mental health issue. So, who? but the thing is, I feel like this, this person that you, your, your, your person, I feel like they're thinking about you a lot and you're not communicating with them and this person misses you and they're disappointed they understand why you set some form of boundary they understand why you stood up for yourself why you, why you put your foot down they understand why you did yeah as i'm talking and saying that divine feminine pops out with defending yourself standing your ground yeah yeah i don't Oof. There's some deceit and some backstabbing. Somebody is not to be trusted here in a situation here. We have snake energy here. 
So you may be feeling like you had to stand your ground with someone who was a snake energy. Look at that, snake energy. Somebody here was betrayed. Someone here definitely is having money issues. They made really bad choices when it came to money. When it came to how something looked. And I really, I don't, show me more here. Yeah, definitely was dealing with a player here. Ooh, somebody did. I'm like picking cars up and turning them over. Player, okay. Somebody even, for some of y'all, got caught being a player. Caught doing something. Betraying somebody, okay. Because they're definitely not to be trusted here. That, that, didn't we see the Ten of Swords? The caught up energy. Somebody got caught cheating. Okay, they did. They definitely did. And there was a yeah, there was a lot of chaos happening in this, in this masculine's life. Um, but somebody definitely is having legal problems right now. Somebody's life is not good. Divine feminine, again. Don't we have divine feminine out here twice? We do. We do. Look at this. Show me more about this divine feminine. I didn't fall out. Show me more about divine feminine, please. Thank you. Overthinking and getting a room, a hotel, motel. This is. You could have caught. Somebody could have got caught cheating. I don't know if it was the divine feminine or the divine masculine. Good lord. Show me more about this divine feminine. They could have cheated on you, but whoever did the cheating definitely regrets what they did. They regret maybe for some of y'all walking away from you. Um, yeah. Now they want to talk to you here. Somebody, I feel like, is having to explain themselves. They want to explain themselves. They want to tell you how they did never meant to hurt you. Um, that they're actually a very good person. They want your forgiveness, okay? But they definitely don't feel like you're going to forgive them. But they are trying to figure out, what can I say? What can I do to get my person to come back? How can I make this right? Twin flame just fell on the floor. I'm not picking that up. So for some of y'all, this is a situation dealing with a twin flame. Uh, what else here? drama queen. Yeah, somebody loves chaos. Whoever this person is dealing with, they love chaos because there's an energy of a drama queen out here, somebody that really loves chaos. And then there's somebody here who's like, chill or telling somebody to chill out. I feel like this is two different people. Nosy. Somebody's getting a closer look at something. Child, somebody might be going to jail. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Okay. Can you show me the collector's energy, please? <laughs> Let's dig a little bit deeper. So that's what's going on with them over there. All right. Um, yeah. Drama, chaos, betraying, player energy, a bunch of people sleeping with a bunch of people. Somebody's going to the room, getting a room, going to the hotel. Oh, the devil card just wanted to pop out. Oh. Somebody may have a, possibly may have a mental illness. Can you please show me the collector's energy, please? One card. Hold on, y'all. These cards is like, I see more energy of chaos falling out. Give me one card at a time. Current energy for the collective. Six of Pentacles in reverse. Mm, show me the current energy of the collective. You may have stopped giving to this person. The death card. You stopped giving Scorpio energy. You stopped giving to this person and you ended it. Mm, yeah, justice. Some of y'all, somebody is ending something and they losing money, by the way. Somebody took some money or you just stopped giving to this person. Two of Swords. 
But again, there's still the energy of somebody being in denial or not still not seeing something clearly. Show me more of the collective's energy. Yeah, you're walking away though. Okay, somebody is walking away from this burden. It's over. It's over. It is over. Okay. O V E R. Look at that. The devil the devil card Capricorn came right back out again with the two of cups. It's a toxic connection here. Somebody's like trying to they know they need to walk away from a toxic connection, but they're in denial about it. I don't know what I'm gonna call this. Let's find out more information. I don't know what I'm gonna title this as yet. Maybe we'll, we'll three of swords just Jesus. The three of pentacles, the ten of swords, and the three of swords. Capricorn and Libra energy. There was a heartbreak, a betrayal, obviously, right? In a in a contract or in a commitment or whatever, okay. I feel like there's two paths, two options, two people, two lovers, whatever it is. Somebody could have, may have gone to jail. I don't know. Like you said, somebody may have some legal problems. Um, show me more here. Ace of Wands, Two of Wands. 222 could be very significant for you. Look up 222. We got three twos here um, and two threes. Um, I'm sorry, no. Is this a two, three of wands? We have two pairs. That's what I meant to say. We have two threes. We have three pairs. Dang. We got two twos, two threes, and two tens. So... Could be some mirroring happening here. There's definitely a theme when it comes to pairs. And there's definitely a theme when it comes to the number three. Somebody wants a new beginning and they're thinking about it. But see, here's the thing. Like someone here, the person that wants a new beginning, they, I feel like we're in denial for a long, long time. They still could be in denial or this is them coming out of that denial or no, realizing there's something there. Something happens. Some chaos and some drama happens. Over this cheating, someone gets caught. There's this huge fight, betrayal. Somebody could have even gone to jail or someone has some form of legal issue. Um, the situation can could involve somebody in their mom or if they're with the divine feminine that they could be in a contract with. You know, or married to, or have a kid with. Somebody could have found out someone else is not their child. Okay, with the betrayal energy here in the Sun card here in reverse with the Ace of Swords. Someone stopped giving somewhere. Someone could have ended something. They could have stopped paying child support. They could have stopped paying some bills or something of that matter. I. But somebody here, after all of that, now somebody wants a new beginning and they're looking towards a different direction. Now somebody's work. Think about the future and they're ready to leave. They're ready to pack it up and and be on their way. Um, the Matrimony by Wale featuring Usher is playing. So if there's a question of my love, you got it. A question of my heart, it doesn't belong to anyone but you. Oh, and he's saying, don't worry, I got plans for you. So somebody is thinking of some plans for sure with the Ace of, Ace of Wands being here with the Three of Wands and the Two of Wands, honey. Somebody got plans for somebody else. I I don't know who has the mental illness going through the issues, who cheated on who. Uh, somebody could have also gotten sick with the Four of Swords being here in reverse. Show me more. What else? Somebody want a new beginning somewhere else. Somebody get ready to move on. Okay. Somebody's going somewhere else. They're leaving this drama. They're leaving this chaos. Six of six of swords. Okay. That's moving away from the, the, the chaos and the and the ripples in the water, which is all this drama and all this shit. You know, they're moving on to something calmer. Okay. The water is getting ready to be serene. Where they're going, they they want to find peace. Okay. Um, 
they Aries, Aquarius energy with the fool. Somebody wants a like I said, a new beginning with the Ace of Wands being here, and they're planning that. They're thinking about that. Ten of Pentacles, in, you know. Listen, somebody wants this somewhere else. Weird. Maybe this person, maybe for some of y'all, this person wasn't married or they were getting a divorce or I don't. That's how the cards are coming out. I hope it makes sense. Oh, the, ace, the eight of pentacles just came out of reverse though. Somebody may not have any money. They may not see how this is going to work. They may not have faith that it could work with this eight of pentacles being here in reverse. They don't know how they're going to make it work. Okay, now we have two eights here. 88. Somebody could be born in 1988. The hierophant is here. If someone is in a connection with somebody, I'm telling you, they... Um, this person definitely wants a commitment with you. And whoever they, you know, yeah, they want to talk. Page of Wands. It's typically good news. It's also action and excitement, fun, flirty energy, right? Um, but the um, hair front is here with the eight of wands. Give me one more, one more on this eight of pentacles in reverse. Ooh, that nine of pentacles just wanted to come out. Whatever this person, wherever this person was, it wasn't working for them anymore. This could be you. It's not working for you anymore, Divine Feminine. I don't know. I just, um, you know where you lie in this situation. Somebody is getting ready to be single. Eight of Pentacles in reverse, please clarify that. The, yeah, this is this emperor that we're talking about. Show me more for the emperor, please. The Ace of Pentacles, like I said, they want a new beginning and they want... They want something with you. Four of Wands. Could be your twin. Twin is already here on the floor. Look at this. Like, they do want a family with you. This could be totally new too. But I really feel like this is the same person. All right. Four of Wands, reuniting, family, stability. Queen of Cups, they see you as this. I feel like you are somebody else. You're, you're just, yeah, you're somebody else. Underneath the Queen of Cups is the temperance energy, angel energy. You're a healer. Underneath that is the Two of Cups. Eight of Cups, you walked away in the past from this person. Or you walked away from some this situation, possibly, and you've got something new coming in. Some of y'all do. But for a lot of y'all, this is like the same person. Um... <laughs> They, um, but they got drama somewhere else or they had drama somewhere else. So for some of y'all, if this is a new person coming towards you, this is just what they went through in their past. That could be for a few of y'all too. Um, but definitely could be a twin. So let's pull some cards for those of you dealing with, for the person you're dealing with, like you know them. Show me the energy here of this past person, this past masculine, male or female, okay? <clears throat> they really love you and they do want to be with you. They really love you and they want to be with you. Look at that, okay? You give this person butterflies. You, They said, you are the one that I've been looking for my whole life. Um, I hear a million voices in my head telling me things that I should have said. Please forgive me. Um, Trey Song's drugs, drugs is playing right now. What? I don't think I heard this song before or it's been a long time since I heard it. Trey Song's drugs with a Z. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I, so I don't really know what that song is about, but there's a, a the number eleven is in a heart. By the way, that's the cover for the song. So the, another confirmation of four of wands and with twin flame energy being here, everything will be all right. Please trust me. So you, this person feels like 
you, you they don't believe that it's gonna work or they don't think that you're gonna want to work on things with them with this eight of pentacles being here in reverse on top of somebody i think may have experienced some um financial issues or whatever but they do want you to trust them and they they want you to know that they're it's gonna work out something's gonna work out they feel like it i don't understand why do i keep messing things up yeah in the past, this person showed up as being King of Pentacles in reverse, making the most wrong choice ever. So for some of y'all, this person is realizing something. The person from the past, they're trying to get their act together. They were betrayed by a karmic who may have some form of mental illness. Uh, for some of y'all, the past person is the masculine and they have a mental illness and they're the one who betrayed you and cheated and lied um and you just got oh you're over it you're at the point where you don't you're emotionless you don't even care and there's something new coming in for you there's something new coming in for you okay and whoever this new person is everything about them regardless of this emperor get ready to come in wants commitment all the cards of commitment are here look at this all the cards of commitment are here. Okay. So I'm just saying, you know what I mean? It's up to you. Um, do I want to pull? Let's see what, what else is here for you. Give me one second. Show me more here about this King of Pentacles in reverse. Some of y'all, this is a Pisces. Some of y'all are a Pisces dealing with a King of Pentacles. And, you know, and see, when you were with them, um, when y'all were together, this person was definitely a player. They didn't want commitment. They just wanted to have fun with you. I feel like y'all had a lot of patience with them. You were very kind with them, right? Because you, you showed up as the Queen of Cups with the with temperance energy y'all were real sweet and kind and patient and nice to this person and they're hoping that you're going to show up in the same way after they already betrayed you and lied and cheated and trade and betrayed and backstabbed you um and it's this person knows that you're, you're not going to believe anything that they have to say because of the things that they've already done they've done enough who would believe anything else the boy who the boy who cried wolf shit, he, he lied 10 times already. Who's really going to believe him? I don't blame you. Um, yeah. Dude, this person, now this person wants to know if you ever really love them. So be careful. This person tries to guilt trip you. Or for some of y'all, you feel like this person used to guilt trip you. You know? And that's a form of manipulation because that's exactly what they used to do. They miss your touch, okay? And they want to communicate with you. They miss hearing your voice for a lot of y'all. Um, uh, let's see. Let's get a few more. What else does this person want to say to the collective from the past? I don't, oh, I don't want to be the reason you cry. Yeah. This person, like, disrespected you and was very hurtful when they betrayed you and deceived you. They know you're not going to trust them. Yeah, this person's done pretending that they feel okay, that they don't miss you. They're done pretending and acting like everything is fine. Um, now they want to come towards you and make something right here. I don't know. I don't know. This person wants to know if they're going to see you again. Okay. I'm telling you, this person wants a new beginning with you. They want a commitment with you because they're saying you're all I ever wanted. I, mean, I just heard, you're all I ever wanted. I want you. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> you filled me up with happiness. Goofy. Maybe y'all was goofy. I don't know. I did just feel goofy. Um, I wish things were different on the bottom of the deck. I know I was a fool, but I am truly sorry. Can't make it up. I know I was a fool, but I'm truly sorry. Well, hit the like button, y'all. If you need a personal reading, that information is below in the description box. Um, you can click the Etsy shop link or you can email me the emails there too. Let's see.
Who else you could be dealing with? Let's pull some zodiac signs. Um, we have what is this? We have Leo, we have Aries, we have Pisces, Virgo, and Capricorn. Okay. I love y'all. Have a good night or a good day and happy holidays. Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Okay. Bye.